Hey YouTubers, it's Shite Frenzy here again, and this is a trade video for Brea Girl 1414. So, this is all the stuff which I can make or trade for you. So, I'll do the things which I can give you straight away, and after that, I'll give you the things which you can order from me, and I'll make them, and then we can, and then I'll send them off. Okay, so first of all, I have this like umbrella really nice and it's got a nice pattern on it it's a cocktail stick no it's like a cocktail umbrella like the ones which you get on holiday and it can come down like you just yeah and then it has this little bit and you just push it up and up and up and up and then it'll go up eventually so yeah that's that um then I have this like beaded sash, it's like got beads on it and everything and it fits the Tinker Stallion. All this stuff, all this stuff is Schleich and very traditional so yeah. But all this stuff at the moment which I'm trading like straight away is Schleich size so there you go. It just fits like that. Then I have this like netting material which you can use for like um, hay nets. I would make them for you but I don't have any hay <laughs> so that wouldn't go very well. And then I have this actual Schleich halter which just fits on her but it's exactly the same as then one's there, like if I get one, but the lead rope doesn't come off. If you want it to come off and me attach a clasp to it, I can, which is that one. These ones you can have as well, but they're on my other video, which I will up upload. Okay, so it'll be exactly like that, but in green and with a rope attached. Okay, then I have this bag of bedding which I don't want anymore because I've already got one in there, like there, so if you want that you can have it, it just says bedding on it and it's real bedding, it's like this stuff. So yeah, don't ask me why a coat hanger is in my store and why fencing is. Um, then I have this like flower bed, and it's like quite tacky around here. But I can strip all that off and then repaint it blue or something. Oh, but um, yeah, it's sturdy. It's very sturdy. Um, so yeah, or if you want me to keep that stuff on it to make it look quite old, then I can. So there we go. Um, then I have this Schleich blanket, which I didn't make. It's actually the Schleich one. It came with that halter, but I don't want it. So it's not broken at all. I've barely used it. I only put it on him to show you, but it's always been sitting on that pole there. So there it is. It's really thin. It's really thin. It's kind of like a summer blanket. But there we go. Nothing's broken of it. Nothing's fraying that I know of. So yeah, there's that. Then I have this mountain block which I don't want, it's quite crooked, but it's okay, unless you want me to make a new one for you. Just offer on any of this stuff if you want it, then just say I'll add it to the list. But yeah, it's that cool. So it's really cute. Then I have this winner's sash. 
which I made just randomly and I don't want it. It has like ink around it. So yeah. But that was just marking off but I forgot to use a non inky pen. But I used a fountain pen on that. Don't ask me why. I was silly and that was when I first started collecting Schleich. So yeah, there's that. Um, then I have this dropping pile. It's like a poop pile. But yeah, it's Schleich size again. It's just the right size, I'd say. But yeah, it's like blotchy. But you can repaint it. But it it looks really cool. And it's just a pile of poop. There's underneath. So it just st sits in your stable like the bits there. Yes, my barn is a state. I really need to sort it out. So yeah, that's their poo. And then um I have this saddle pad which I don't want anymore. It's made of felt. I can make different ones if you want me to. They'll all be the same size. Like that. They're quite big. But it's good. Could be used as a bareback pad. But yeah. So there's them. Um, then I made Butterscotch this halter which I don't want anymore because she's already got one. So it's maroon and it comes with this lead rope which is detachable and it's just coiled up but when you get it I'll uncoil it for you. Like when, if you want it, I'll uncoil it for you and send it off. But yeah, it's a nice halter. It's really cute. It's got a buckle there which is working and you just slip it down, it comes undone and then you just pull it off. And there we go. It fits the halfling and mare. So yeah, there it is. And the lead rope has a working clasp and it's just that but I'll unravel it for you. So yeah, and the halter has a chin strap just there, which has a jump ring on it, so you can attach things to it. Um, so yeah, that's all the stuff which is already made and everything which I don't want. Um, so yeah, and then, as I said that, um... Then all the stuff which I can make for you, but it'll take time. Like, it's not already made for you. You just say what you want. So, first I have a traditional grooming kit. I can make it Schleich size as well, which is this size. It's quite big for Schleich. There's the traditional. Yeah, it's very big for Schleich. <laughs> this one. But, oh well. Okay, so um, it will come with not a lead rope. It won't come with that. That's just a random lead rope in there. Okay, so it will come with a sponge. And it will come in any colour. Um, it will come with um, some hoof oil, like in a pot. It's just got like a little brush. And there's the pot. So you just put it like that. And there we go. It says a hoof oil with a little hoof on it. But yours will just be plain. <coughs> Camera fell. <laughs> so yeah, there's the pot. It, it'll be neat. As neat as I can get it. So yeah. And then other things that will come with, it will come with a body brush, which is very big for Schleich. 
it'll come with a face brush, which is like a weird brush, so it'll be a nice one. And then it will come with a curry comb, if you want it to, but curry combs are really, really, really hard to make. And to make them non-tacky is really hard as well. But you just say what you want in the grooming kit. Or you can just have the grooming box and just add your own stuff in it. And then it'll come with a hoof pick. So yeah. So that's the, that's the grooming kit. If I just put everything in it. And that's a traditional size lead rope. It'll be made out of wool, which is like all plaited. And it's got clasp as well. But the clasps are exactly the same size, I think because it's annoying to buy different hardware and it packs on the money and the costs so it's really hard um next i can make you a salt look this is a like size one as you can see but i can make traditional if you want me to but there it is it'll just come in plain white so sorry for that, and so will the hoof pick in there. And then it'll come with string, and then a little loop there to hang it up. So it can hang up on most things. You just thread it through things, and then it can hang up. So yeah, salt licks. Um, then I can make you like a n notice board thing this is mine but if you just send me like a template of your thing and I can stick it on it'll be card and that's what it'll look like and you can just put it up like that it can be traditional size as well again but what I'll probably do is just not have the card bit and it'll just be like a stand like that so you just thread it through but this one's actually glued on so yeah it's good for a barn tour because you can just have it like that and it'll just have all the information on it and then it'll have like a little picture and I can make you signs like that to stick around the place and last but not least, I can make you some Schweik size Cavaletti jumps. So, like, here's a trotting pole. And it's made out of doweling wood. It's good hardwood. And then there's the jumps. So, the size of them is that. They're quite big for Cavaletti jumps, but it's still good. And the frames are like that. So yeah, I think I got my calculations wrong on that one. That's why it's a weird size. It's kind of like slanted. But all of them are like that. <laughs> Well, that one looks okay. But yeah, they'll come around the same size. But these ones were test runs because I flattened the bottom. But I will get them right. These ones are mine, so they're not as good quality as yours would be if you wanted them. And this wood is really, really light wood where it's balsa wood. So it's a really soft wood. So yeah, each set will come with two frames and a pole, but just like say how many frames you want, and like these are separate frames which I mean, so like one frame is like that on its own, but 
to make a proper Cavaletti set you need two frames and a pole so yeah so that's the trade um, options so just ask me and I'll see what I can do I can make little things around the barn like these and I can make you a notice board just like mine um, I can make feed bags um, I can make, I would say that I'd make you a saddle, but my saddles are not as good. Um, you can, if you wanted, you could have my feed bin. It's like a tic-tac box full of feed, if you wanted it. So yeah, it's all dry stuff in there so that doesn't come mouldy. So yeah, it's like herbs and everything. Um, another thing which I don't want is these hooks and rope. Like they can be, they can attach things, just like a massive hook. So like I'll hook onto things and then if I just get there we go. And I have two of these, which I don't want. So yeah, if you want that, um, I'm not gonna sell this, but I don't know if I can still open. Oh well. So yeah, that's the stuff which I've got for sale. Um, so just PM me what you would like or something. Oh, and you asked about my traditional halters. Um, if I find sapphires, I'll just put it on her quickly. I'll show you what they look like. They can only come in one colour, which is maroon. So sorry for that. If you ever wanted one. Um, but yeah, my ribbon is so low at the moment. It's horrific but yeah unless I try and like get some ribbon but it'll take ages because I can barely get any time to go anywhere sorry for this I'm just putting her halter on to show you Okay, so here it is. It'll only come in her size or his size, so it probably won't fit draft horses. But yeah, that's it. And it'll come with, and it's got like a little chin strap and little jump ring on it. It comes with a homemade buckle. So yeah, but um, I'd prefer not to make halters because my wire is low, I've only got like 10 centimeters left but I can make, I'll see what I can do so yeah, I can make traditional blankets but it'll have to be tie-ups and or just over the head so yeah, bye